The payoff on this hot desert hilltop is a series of aerial bombings carried out with accuracy and no collateral damage. Bringing the attack on target is the goal for Staff Sergeant Jordan Calhoun, Victor, two, a Joint one, Terminal three, Attack Controller, three, or six, JTAC. One, niner, none. His training mentor is First Lieutenant Gabriel Bird, JTAC instructor. Anytime you can bring the young guys out, um, especially a situation like NTC, um, it's great because they kind of get to see it happen. The scenario says friendly forces are approaching an enemy airfield and close air support is called in to clear the way. RQ2, good hits, good hits. In this instance, the friendlies exist like on airspace. paper and the airfield and is a gathering of old trucks in the middle of Leech Lake at Fort Irwin's National Training Center. Bird has 10 years of JTAC experience. We'll the target area and we'll uh, talk to you on from your For Calhoun, spot. this is number 14. For a JTAC, proficiency is a blend of communication, math, and aircraft control, essential elements for strategic targeting delivered by a military aircraft traveling at speeds faster than the blink of an eye. Uh, it's tough. F-16s are small and they're pretty high, so we're always trying to find the aircraft. Uh, sometimes we are required to see it, depending on the type of attack we're doing. A total of six runs took place on this day. 1.4 kilometers. All critical south. information was integrated and correctly communicated. Sergeant Calhoun has another notch on his belt. Bird calls it a BDA good day. Mission successful. Two enemy command and control compounds neutralized. Gil McCabe. Thanks for the work. Fort Irwin.